Hi, this is the President Michael, and hopefully this video will see the light of day. Uh, it's my very first video on YouTube. I've been watching YouTube for a long time, but I never actually post any videos. Let's be honest. I'm not Bill Gates with computers. I don't exactly know how to get these things going, even though I was born in the computer generation. But this is my first ever autograph video, and I hope it sees the light of day and everyone gets to see it. Okay, well, my first thing I want to show... It's not a TTM. It is. A, it's a. It's an auction. Um, it's an auction purpose uh, purchase. I'm a little nervous. Like I said, it's the first video I've ever done. But okay, it's a lot of autographs. And here's the first one. See right there. That's Tinsel Corey. She was in um, you know, Twilight series. And I'm not a big fan of Twilight series, but I got this. It was really cheap. It was like 99 cents. And it's signed by her. Now there's several of them here. Here's another autograph. That I'm, I'm very, actually very happy to get this one. This guy is Theodore Bickle. I've not been able to get him through the mail. It's signed there in the corner. It's a little hard to see. I mainly wanted him because he was in Star Trek. If I remember correctly, I think he played Worf's father. His human father. I've been wanting him for a long time. Okay. Here's another one. This Aldia Carter. And I couldn't find anything on her. I got this really cheap, too. This was only like 99 cents. I wonder if she was um, an author that wrote poetry. And it's signed right there. I could not find a thing on her on the internet. And you know, on the internet, you can find pretty much anything. It's signed right there. And it's from um, August 17, 1931. So if anyone has, knows anything about her, I'd appreciate you to forward me a message. Here's a letter. This one here is signed by Froggy Williams. Mary, Cra oh, Mary Crackley, um, football player, if I remember correctly. I got this also. This one really cheap, too. Hear me. The whole thing. And it's a great photo. Oh, this one I'm really happy about. Besides, I have a small collection of these. This is United States Senator um, letter. It's from um, Andrew Chappelle, Senator from Kansas. It's dated February 20th, 1950. Leave that one last. All right, this is great. This is Fred Wagner. He's a um, Cartoonist, right there. Going back to, I love these cartoons. These are so cool. Really adds to the autograph when you have a photo they wrote or drew. Okay. Now here's another one I bought, and I got this really cheap, two hundred five bucks. It's a letter, Italian. It's from um. 1870. Let me pull it out here. Of course, you've seen the front sheet. And it's written on the back. I don't know who uh, wrote it or signed it. The seller didn't either. Here's the last one, last sheet, and there's the signature. Anyone knows who that is? Let me know. Who knows? It could have been signed by a pope before he was pope. You know, I think you'd be using um better stationery, but you never know. It's a mystery autograph. I love mystery autographs. I love them when I saw the mystery. Here's another one I bought. Oh, let me see. Okay. It's um Jim Huge. Former major league baseball player. He's if I remember correctly, he's deceased now. Okay. A uh, couple other interesting things I picked up. Not really autograph related, but it's cool anyways. Well, this is signed, but I don't know. It's probably not signed anyways. This old baseball ticket thingy or whatever. Or a little contract. A baseball team in Cuba. 1950. It was only like 99 cents. Really cool.
And one other thing I got about this Apex Ten is the Star Trek crew. It's not signed, but I just love Star Trek. Isn't that neat? Okay. Now, uh, here's another lot of stuff that I, I bought. It's only a couple from someone else. But I got it off eBay. And, um, I'll show you. This is Jack, Gloria, and Charlie Brick. Nonsense on the trampoline. From the 1940s. And it's supposed to be signed there, but after looking at it, I think it's all written by the same person. Which is a little disappointing. But, uh, that's okay because I don't know I just love this photo. It's just so neat. I'm assuming this guy's Charlie Brick. This is a, because he's more prominent than the other two. He's looking right at you. But I could not find anything about these three guys. Well, two guys and a gal at all. So if any of you guys know anything about it, I appreciate it. Here's another one of those mystery autographs. I had my eye on this one for a long time. See that guy? He's, had, he's shaking his hand with uh, President Nixon. It's not signed by Nixon. I wish it was. Now the guy thought he wasn't sure who it was either. He called the mystery autograph. He thought maybe like what he reads is Al Podge, and it looks like Al Podge to me too. But I looked all over for Al Podge. I can't find anything. I did combinations. I looked up senators, congressmen from that time. It could be it could be a labor leader. It could be some other celebrity, foreign dignitary. You know, I have a feeling it's an American. It looks like it's signed to Nancy, his name, 32168. Real thick. Kind of like a paint pen because it kind of, kind of cracked a little bit. And it was just about who took the picture. If you have any idea who that is, let me know. Or any of the guys in the photo. Of course, I know who Nixon is. But um, I'd like to know. I have a couple ideas on how I found out. I might try writing to his family or um, the Nixon Library. But do um, you have any uh, information? Well, like I said, this is my first video, and I hope everybody sees it. I've been collecting autographs for a while, and I'm, I don't think I'm going to film one every day. So I don't get enough autographs in to do that. That at least. I, mean, I don't want to do a video on one item and, and waste your guys' and gals' time. I'll probably do it some like weekly. But uh, the next couple videos or so, I'm going to show some of the autographs I got within the last couple months to either TTM or um, in person or um, that I bought. Just so you get an idea about um, you know, what I collect and some of the past successes. Is, but I also want, I want to try to help the community as much as possible. And um, so do people. And I, I, if you've been watching videos for a long time, if you thought I got videos on YouTube, you'll hear some of them. But I highly recommend you watch, um, of course, um, Zane Savage. I've been watching for uh, several months now. Stacy Schaefer is another good one. Actually, Stacy Schaefer is doing kind of a campaign. You know, we are autographs drawn to try to support the community. And I'm all for that. I want to help the community as much as possible too. So um, try try to get involved with that. And um, Tennessee Valley TTM is another great guy to watch. You know he hasn't been on for about a month or so, but um, he has a lot of great videos. They all do. So make sure you look up their archives and see what they do. Um, well, that's it for now. I'm gonna I'll give more out more information about myself in the next few videos or so and show you some of the other goodies I got. Now hopefully you like them. You can tell I'm a big movie fan with posters back here. One time I want to do a video to show you all my posters. Because I got them all over here. And um... It's so cool. Well anyways. Thanks for watching and uh... you know comment. Comment below. Let me know what you think. Um, if you have any questions. Any comments about the video. Any comments about um, the autographs I showed you, especially if you know who those couple mystery autographs are, the 1870s letter. That's written in Italian. At least that's the guy I thought it was written in Italian. He could have been wrong. I don't know. I don't speak Italian. I tried taking a language in school. I took French, and I sucked at it. And if you know who that guy is, 
that um, or any of those guys in that photo that was taken with Nixon, especially the one in the middle. I'm assuming he's the one who signed it. Let me know. All right. Well, that's it. Thank you for watching, and um, you'll see me again soon. Okay. Bye.